All right, we're gonna do half of this Cool Whip into this mixture of two packets of pudding. We got two packets of that pudding filling. We're just gonna stir this together. All right, that looks good. So let's set that aside. We got some honey graham crackers. You don't have to get the honey ones, but I really like those. We're gonna grab, we're gonna half those graham crackers and we're gonna set them all the way across a parchment paper lined baking sheet. One more. Okay, now that we have that on our pan, we're gonna grab this mixture. And we're just gonna pour this on here, the whole thing. Spread that out. Get all that goodness out of there. We don't wanna leave any of this out. Now let's just spread this out. Kind of carefully because these graham crackers like to squirm a little bit. Okay, now let's put this in the refrigerator just for a few minutes and let's let this chill. Probably about five minutes. All right, we got the cream jet puff marshmallow mixture. This is the seven ounce. So just want to get all this out of there. Now we're going to grab a block of cream cheese. Make sure that's already thawed out. Dump that in there. Let's stir this together. We're gonna grab the rest of that Cool Whip that we used earlier with the pudding. We'll put that in there and that's gonna help us stir this up a lot. We'll fold that in. It's gonna turn into a more, even more creamy texture. Now, what we want to do is we want to spread this on top of the chilled uh, pudding that we had. So this is going to be our marshmallow layer. Just a fun way to make some s'mores. Now I'm intentionally leaving the outsides uh, kind of barren because I'm going to squish this down with the rest of the graham crackers. So you're going to get your squares. You're gonna press down, and this recipe is gonna blow your guys' minds. Okay, now let's put this in the freezer for about six hours until it's frozen, and then we're gonna try it out. Ooh, look at that. Man, that is nice and frozen. It's like, you can't even cut it. Ugh. So you're supposed to cut it in squares, because obviously we laid it out in squares. Um, I don't know if I'm getting exactly on it, but I think it's okay. I'm just gonna take this corner one to make it easy for you guys to see. Whoa. Wow, that turned out nice. Man, real nice and hard and that's like not gonna crack or go anywhere. All right, let's try this out. Got me a plate so that I don't eat over this because you guys don't like that. So I'm not gonna do it even though I really want to, but I won't. Okay, I'm gonna eat it. Whoa. That's so funny. Like it has the, the nostalgic taste of s'mores, but it's like freezing cold in my mouth. That is such a cool snack. You guys have to try this one. So good. Mmm.